go of me. Sit down. Seriously, let go of me. Sit down. In a series of intriguing events, law enforcement officers found themselves entangled in unpredictable situations. About to get tased! About to get tased! Each incident unfolded with its own twists and turns, and the officers faced the utmost defiance while apprehending the criminals. We gotta do that. We gotta do that because I'm telling you, you're gonna get a lawsuit. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait! What's going on? Get on the ground! Get on the ground! From confrontations over trespassing to disorderly conduct in public places, here are some incidents when dumb criminals fail to outsmart genius cops. I'm not doing nothing wrong. I'll give you my name, don't touch me. The incident revolves around a woman named Brandy. On August 7, 2022, in Las Cruces, Doña Ana County, New Mexico, the officers were informed about a woman exhibiting disorderly behavior in a restaurant. Hence, they hastened to the location to conduct a comprehensive inquiry. Upon reaching the scene, Brandy's obstinate demeanor only heightened the suspicions. Eventually, the situation escalated to a new height, further intensifying the tension. Where is she? Where is she going? She's looking over the yellow Okay, where is she going? Wearing blue tank top or is that her? With the green? Hey! Map! 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 I know you hear me. Get off the phone. Hey! Come here. Hi. Oh, sh hello? Hi. 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 Uh, what happened? That manager started yelling at another girl for helping me. Okay. Hold on. I'll call you back, Dad. And? Okay. So I got and I told her not to out the girl. Okay. She said I'm calling the cops to me because I started yelling at her. Okay. Because the other girl was cashier's helping me and this girl was i was asking questions all right so i don't have to stop okay ma'am 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 i have to get your information because you're getting trespassed with me okay ma'am okay okay let me get your name ma'am ma'am yes you do yes you do why because you're being trespassed here okay you have to i don't ma'am okay I'm not doing nothing wrong. I'm not doing nothing wrong. I'll give you my name. Don't touch me. Put your hands behind your back. I'm not doing nothing wrong. Ow! What? Why are you doing this? Stay in your car. Stay in your car. Here, call my lawyer. Call my lawyer. I'm not doing nothing wrong. Why are you doing? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Well, tell me why. Pass that point, all right? Put your hands behind your back. You're gonna detain me for what? You're gonna detain me? Ma'am. You're gonna detain me for what? What are you gonna detain me for? Stop resisting. I'm not doing nothing wrong. I came to get a burger. Ma'am, stop. Stop resisting. Put then tell me why I'm getting arrested. You're getting detained. Put your hands behind What does that mean? Right. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Ow! I don't know what that means. I'm burning. And I'm pregnant. Despite the officer's utmost cooperation, the situation grew more intricate as Brandy's bizarre behavior continued. Later, a startling revelation further complicated the officer's already daunting task. We'll grab it. We'll grab it. We'll grab it. Why? Because I think we're going to burger and I told her. Look, let me give you my receipt. I got her name because she was telling the girl off. We'll get to that. Okay. 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 You're really gonna put me in jail? All right. No, we'll sit in the car. Can I clean my face? I have dirt in my mouth. We'll clean it up in a minute. You need to sit down in the unit. What the? F we told you plenty of times. What for? What? For coming a burger? Coming and get, get a burger? 
Get your you're going to really right. arrest me. Get your feet. Just answer my question. You're, you're detained, detained right now. What does that mean? What do you think it means? Going to jail? No, detained is you're detained. You going to jail. jail. Pending our investigation. Kick your feet in the car. You're not free to go right now. Doesn't mean you're going to jail. Wow. All right, grab her stuff. Please put my face. We I have like road okay. rash all over my face. Okay, yes, ma'am. You do have little cuts to your chin. All right. We have medical tissue on the way. They're gonna check up, check up on you. Okay. I want you guys' information as well. Okay. It'll be and I want to file a lawsuit for the. Okay. I can't get a burger. And I told the manager off for yelling at the girl for doing the job. Okay, ma'am. All right. And this happens to me. I'm getting detained. Whatever yes, that you're means. Detained. It means that you're not that for our investigation as of right what now. What investigation? Because you were you weren't telling us who you were and we're trying to Because I don't need to tell you where okay. and there's no okay. law that says I need to tell you who I okay, am. Okay, ma'am. But you were getting trespassed from the residence. Okay. I need for to tell okay, well okay. I want that girl's right, job because I want corporate's okay. number. Okay, let me Because she had no right to treat you that girl for the way she did. You want an explanation? I'm giving you an explanation. Now let me talk. We're standing up for somebody, this is what okay. I get. Okay, listen. We I had to get your name. Because you were being trespassed from this business, okay? And I'll never so therefore, well, therefore, matter. I needed to get your name. All right? You weren't giving it to me. You at that point you were kind of concealing your identity, okay? I'm so concealing your business who I am. I don't legally have okay, to give anybody right. my name. Well, though. what's your name? What's your name? Why do I? You, you either tell me, me. You either tell me right now, or you will be charged with concealing mm -hmm. identity. Oh my God, Randy. Randy. Do I look like a boy? I didn't hear you. Randy. Phone number? No. Oh. It's for the report. Oh, okay. You want to? You want? You want the report? Five seven one. And the the vehicle and the the person in the white car is your husband. The white car. Married. So that was your husband. Yeah. Okay. I just want to make sure. All right. Are you gonna? Want well, medical tissue? They're gonna go. Yeah, I put blood in my mouth and everything. Okay. So, if you would have just gave me your name, I don't have to though. Legally, with my amendments, I do not have to give anybody my name for any reason. Okay. And I don't feel comfortable because of what shit happened to me by cops before in my past. No, I, being, I don't okay, care. They've been nice too. Nice to I was just about raped by one. Okay. And tased by another. I don't like cops. I don't care okay. what reason. I don't care. I, I, don't, yeah, I was. Yeah. If I was dying, I wouldn't call cops. Okay. Give us a minute. We'll be back. Okay. Eventually, the statements of other witnesses shed light on the severity of the situation. However, mysteries remain beneath the surface, yearning to be unveiled. Stay right there. I'm just going to give you some water, okay? <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I came over here to get a f burger, and the ma the, ma the ma <laughs> what is it called? The Manager. manager. She started yelling at the girl for helping me because she wasn't on the register. And now I'm being arrested. What happened here? I was like, but I mean, like, is it do you need medical treatment, medical assistance, or anything like that? I don't understand. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking to him. I don't know what's happening. I came, you saw me. I came directly to you. I was chasing me down the road. I was going over there to the other store real quick. <laughs> I can't breathe. Betty, you didn't want medical attention or nothing? I did. Okay. Well, we'll just we'll take you to the hospital where somewhere they can treat you whatever you need, okay? Well, what's going to get me out faster? Not going to the hospital or going well, to the we, hospital? We, we still have to get you. If you want medical treatment, we still have to get you to the hospital. Then I don't want medical treatment. I just want to get the out. And what we'll do is I'll have the officers take you to the hospital. And if you don't want to receive treatment, you can just tell them, hey, I don't want no treatment. I just They'll sign you up. I just want to go straight to jail so I can get out. We started getting a little confused because we didn't have grilled chicken. Okay. She's like, I'm sorry, we only make fried. And she's like, this is ridiculous, blah, blah, blah. And then... Um, she's like, I want corporate's number and your boss's number. And I was like, well, she is my boss, you know, okay. I can't do anything about that. And I gave her her name and then, um, when she was like, oh, it's because I told her, I was like, well, you're also being rude, you know, you started talking to me ugly. And she's like, well, I can act ugly if you want me to. I'll throw this in your face. Okay. And I, I too, I was like, well, do it, do it. And okay. then she walked off and I walked off. And okay. then she came back and she's like, I need your name. And Did she ever leave the building and come back? Or she just like walked away? No, and no, she's just sitting here talking. Okay. Did she ever order food? Yeah, she ordered food, but we refunded for the order. Okay. We don't want to serve her. I got you. Um, do you guys just want her trespassed? Or? Yes, please. Okay.
Whenever we come to a respond to a call for service in a business, once you trespass, meaning that they have the right to refuse service to whoever but they she want. She didn't refuse service to me till just two seconds before the officers walked in. She and I said, my when, money she, when she called us, left. okay. When she called us, she said that you weren't willing to leave and that you had to turn on. So, oh no, she so, didn't even yeah, ask me to leave. Yeah, let me, let me give me a second. So when when uh, when they responded and they talked to you, when, when somebody gets trespassed, we usually fill out a little card saying, what's your name, ma'am? Brandy. Brandy, Brandy Flores. You are being trespassed on this location. You are no longer allowed here. And then you will understand <laughs> so that when you come back, then you can get arrested for trespassing, okay? So that's why the officer was asking you for your, your your they information. Tell me I'm getting detained. I don't know what that means, and so he throws me on the ground. What 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 detained mean? Did he throw you on the ground, or did they push they you to the ground? They shoved me down to the ground and made me dirt. That's so why I couldn't so, so that's what I'm saying. So when you say throw, please explain to me because when I throw, I'm this is a throw, yeah. or is it that they help you down? They they hold you to no, the they ground. They did not help me down. Nothing. They threw me to the ground. Like you fell and hit the ground? Yeah, I hit my stomach hard and I hit my shoulder, my face, it dirt, and my glasses came off and broke. So she was in here. Who was uh, the caller? The original caller. They were. Yeah. Was she threatening you to throw the shake at you? Yeah, or? she was threatening to throw the shake at her. And then she was Verbally, just touching her. She never actually did, but she said she was across going to. Oh. Uh, okay, because yeah, because she, she was saying that at no time. Did you guys ever ask her to leave? Um. I don't believe anybody asked her to leave, but she was waiting for her order, and then I had told her, like, we're not going to serve you, we could refund you your order, and that's it, like, and then she just kept going at us, going yeah. at us. Did you guys get to see any portion of interaction that my officers had um, with her? I just saw when she took off running, and she was like, just give me my change, like, I don't, like, and she took off running, and then I saw them have to chase her all the way over. I don't believe your officers were being rude, because they did not, they were walking behind her. Yeah, she was giving us a hard time. A hard I, don't, I really do believe from the bottom of my heart that your officers didn't do anything. She's just being dramatic. So they basically said that they saw when she took off running, but they didn't see when they went hands on with her. Okay, no worries. Or do you want to say, just want to find out if, you, if they, yeah, when she was threatening to throw a shake at you, did you feel threatened like she was actually going to throw it at you? And in all honesty? Honest, she was being aggressive. Yeah. yeah. And then the customers in here, like, she was probably the same in here. And I'm like, yeah, Would you? Okay. So uh, we basically detained her right now. She's in the police car. Would you be willing to pursue charges just for assault, a simple assault? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So we got your information. Basically, what they'll do is we'll we'll summon her to court for the assault that she did on you because she only you know how you felt. You know, did you feel like you're gonna like? She, was she angry when she was threatening you? Through? Oh yeah. She was really so she's threatening you in an angry manner with the, the shake, and she's yeah. gonna. What did she tell you? Just, just... Because when I told her. Mm -hmm. Um. I told her you were being rude to us too. I mean, you started talking to me in an ugly manner. And she said, Do you want me to be rude? Because I can throw this shake at you right now. And I was like, then do it. Like, I'm not going to lose my job if you throw it at me. I'm not going to do anything to it. And did she raise it up like in a manner that made you believe that she's No, gonna... she, I guess she didn't hear me. She just walked away. Okay. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good, ma'am. Thank you guys so much, right? Okay. We'll go ahead and deal with her now. Okay, and then... We're going to trespass for an Okay, and then we're already, we're off the clock already, so are we able to leave or should Yes, ma'am, no, you, no, you guys are done. Who do you want us to give the trespass card to? To the manager, please, Philip. Okay. Philip, we'll give it to Philip. And then All right. the charges, but... We'll so, so we'll, what we'll do is we'll charge the assault on you, okay? Because you honestly felt that she was going to throw it yeah, at you? Okay, that's all, that's what we need. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll charge her with the assault. And if she decides to fight it in court, then what we'll do is then we'll just call you so you can testify and tell us how you felt when, when she's going to throw a shake at you. Oh. Make sense? Yes, sir. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. With each fleeting moment, the situation underwent remarkable upheaval, resulting in a dramatic change. How law enforcement would tackle the circumstances is yet to be seen. Did you get a hold of her husband or no? No. Wow. I can't tell if those are the actual sleeping pills or if those are those new blues. Mm. And they don't have the stamp on them. So it's made me think they might be blues. Maybe. I would just seize them and then uh, send an email to Metro. Or, I mean, we can, I don't know if anybody has a test kit. We can test it. Might be worth it. Is that Sarge? Yeah, I'll ask him. So, Ms. Martinez, this is what this is. It just is an advisory for trespassing here at the Lauderburger. You cannot come back here, okay? So if you step foot over here and they call us back, you can decide to go to jail for a criminal trespassing, okay? This is me just telling you. Okay? Do you have any questions specific to that? <laughs> no. No? Okay. How you doing, man? Hey, brother, here's the trespass card for her. Okay. So if she comes back, just call us. Okay. 
Uh, but she's gonna be she's gonna go to jail today. Okay. She's got a couple charges that she's gonna get hit with. So she calls back. Just keep keep that in the place where your employees can find it. And then if she comes back, just call us. All right. Okay. Thank you, brother. Yes, sir. What happened? What did they tell you? So the little girl that you said you were talking to, the one with the glasses. She told me that you, you threatened her to throw the sh in her face. That you're I being. So I, I'm just telling. I'm, I'm, I'm just. I'm just telling what she told me. Yeah, don't be upset with me. I'm just let, letting you know exactly what she told me. I'm not. not I'm not here to to tell you what you said or what she said. I gotta tell you. You're asking me what she said. Yeah. I'm telling you. So she she says what she told me. Okay. She says that when you were at the counter, you were being very rude, and that you told her, "Oh, you you want me to be." I'll throw the shake in your face, and I don't know if it's true. I'm just telling you what she told me. Make sense? And I'm not saying that. Remember, there's always a, your side, her side, and then in between there's I the was truth. Defending the other little girl. And the other little being, that was being yelled at by the manager for no reason. And the manager says that you started. Then, then after that, she started getting in the way, and you started getting mad at her too, and started no, cussing no, I her. No, wasn't that that the little girl. I was no, not at the at the other the one with the the lady with the mask. She's the manager. What do you? Mean? lady with the mask no, no 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 i was asking the lady with the mask what the girl's names were so that i can make the report in the corporate about got, the manager i got it i got it and so the manager says that you were upset so they just all they compl all they all they told me man is that you were so being why am they, i being arrested so the lady wants to press charges on you for assaulting so the assault 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 so let me explain what assault means mm -hmm. okay? assault means that you that she just your demeanor just your angriness your the way you were and you threatened to throw the shake at her and you had the shake in your hand you had the means and opportunity and she actually believed that you're gonna throw a shake at her it's called an assault it's a simple assault not a i'm not telling you're going it's a prison charge so so just letting you know so that's the reason why when they try to stop you and they try to talk to you and you refuse to give them your name at that point they had the right to talk to you and ask you i didn't know that i was told by my lawyers Previously, Correct. I didn't have to. There's certain times. There, there's certain times when you are a, a suspect in an investigation, and I say suspect means that you're a participating party in an investigation that the officer has justified. So what's going to happen next? We'll take you to the jail, and then you'll have your chance in court to per, to present to the lady. This I don't know how she felt assaulted, but she did, and she on she's a little girl. And she's like I felt like she was going to throw the shake at me. Honestly, like deep down in my heart, she says, I felt like she was going to. She was so mad that she was going to throw the shake at my face. I wasn't even mad at her. I was, talk, I, I was telling the manager. <laughs> y, y como te digo, you speak Spanish? Yes. Y como te digo, I don't, yo no sé. He's, she's the one that said it. I mean, only you and her know that dialect that went in between you guys. Only that, maybe you're, that's just your personality. And she took it like you're being more mad than you normally are. Make sense? Pero you're, you're better. I was just telling the manager to leave the little girl alone because she's picking on her. And the fact that you said, I'm going to throw a shake at it. It's... I didn't say I was going to throw a shake at it. I said, if I was mad at you, I could have thrown a shake at you. But I didn't throw yeah, no and shake. She's, and she said that you told her, she says, you want me to throw my shake at you? And no, then, I didn't even cuss. And then she's, her. yeah. And she said, you cut. So, no, no, like I said, I'm not arguing with you. I'm not saying that you what you're telling me is not true. Unfortunately, that is why you were going to get, you. that's why the officer needed to talk to you. Now, if you would have stopped and, and been at least reasonable and say, you know what, officer, what the f are you? Okay, my name is so-and-so. What the f wrong with me? I went in there, they refused services, and maybe things would have turned out a little bit different. Make sense? But I know because of your previous experience with another officers, doesn't make us all the same. Am I being a the, the people in Vegas? No, because I'm not from Vegas and I'm not that person. Pretty much because I'm going to jail for I'm I taking you to jail. No, I'm here to check on you and make sure that you're okay and I'm you're giving you the opportunity. Me that I have to go to jail. No, I make the determination. The officer has his, has to follow his job. When a crime happens, man, we have to do our job. Unfortunately, it's and, and this and this and this is the result. Because look what for lunch and I end up in jail. But it wasn't me that assaulted you. You didn't assault me. I didn't me. assault her see, either. That's what she's saying. You see what I mean? That's what she I, felt. I didn't assault her. I didn't cuss at her. I'm gonna I'm gonna put you in my unit, okay? That way, I can get you up to the hospital, okay? My glasses fall off from them. I got you. Can we put them on? They're not gonna stay on because they're bent. I need to I'll, bend them back. I'll, I'll hold on to it. Time being, I guess. Just watch your head get out. Get towards that door right there. Brandy was charged with concealing identity, resisting or obstructing, and assault. While Brandy tried to conceal her identity 
and displayed ultimate belligerency in a restaurant, our next individual engaged in a confrontation with the cops. But before that, let's see somebody who trespassed in a public lounge and exhibited unsteady behavior. Am I being detained? Yes, you are detained. You are detained. For what? The incident is centered around a woman named Autumn. On December 13th, 2021, in Tallahassee, Leon County, Florida, the officers were called to a public lounge about a woman trespassing. When they reached the location, things turned into a complete mess. Upon arriving at the address, the officers initiated a conversation with Autumn, yet her eccentric behavior only fueled their growing suspicion. Soon, the unexpected twist changed the atmosphere. Yes, sir. And in 602 dispatch will be 1012. Hello. Dallas, the police department. That's good. Hey, you got your ID on you? What? Is it in that first by chance? It's not. It is not? No, it is not. What's your uh, first name? I'm not here to give out any identities. What's your first name? I'm not here to give out any identities, sir. Okay, you're talking just fine. Let's talk normal. What's your first name? No, you're going to yeah, tell us your first right. name. We can do this easy way, hard way. It's up to you. What is your first name, my lady? We're trying to make sure you're safe and find out who you are real quick, okay? If you don't have any warrants or anything like that, then we're good. But I need to get your first name and all that information, okay? I'm just, I just woke up and I do sleep, so I'm just not interested in doing that. Understandable, but this ain't a bedroom. Oh, okay, I'm going to walk to my bedroom. Where's your bedroom? I'm not, I'm not interested in telling you anything right now. I just woke up from the sleep. Uh-huh. What's your first name? I'm not moving out anyway. What's that? I'm not moving out anyway, so I'm so sorry. Well, you're not free to leave right now. Okay, then. So, I'm let's begin sure. with your first name, because if... So, have you, are you familiar with what resisting is? If you don't give me your information, that is what we call resisting. Yes, sir. So, what is your first name, young lady? Um, I don't have one. Open up your purse and give me your ID. I don't have one. Hmm? I don't have one, sir. You don't have one? No, I actually have to get my ID back today. From where? My girlfriend's house. I'll just live. Okay, then give my officer your first name. No, thank you. Huh? No, thank you. no, give him it now. Or we're going to go in cuffs and we're going to walk downstairs and I'll find out who you are later. What? You said she's been trespassed before by officers or anything? Uh, you got the case number? Yes, sir. I was just contacting my supervisor and it looks like her too. Mm hmm. Okay. 602 dispatch. Okay, no, thank you, sir. Say what? This is okay, no, thank you, sir. I had the skateboarding on and I fell asleep. I apologize. Okay. Now they're watching racing. We're just trying to help you make sure you're okay. Can you please move out the way? Huh? Can you please not stand over me like that? I'm not, I'm not trying to intimidate you or anything, but... You, if you live here, why are you sleeping up here on the couch? I said I was watching skateboarding and now oh, you're watching, racing. Oh, you're watching something? Oh, okay. Well, this does not feel good. I thought he was watching. Not yet. I really do no, no, no. Okay, well, I'm going. No, I do. No, 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 stop. Don't touch me. Go, go sit back yeah. down. Autumn's disorderly behavior eventually ensnared the officers in a challenging situation. As tensions mounted, the officers were compelled to take decisive measures to take control of the circumstances. Am I being go, detained? Yes, you are detained. What? You are detained. For what? For an investigation. Go sit down. What type of investigation? I'm not going to take you. Let go of me. Sit down. Sit down. Let go of me. Sit down. Seriously, let go of me. Sit down. Seriously? If you don't let sit down, we'll put you in cuffs. Yeah. Seriously, let okay. go of me. Turn around. Turn around. Stop. 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 Yeah. Stop resisting. Stop. Seriously, let go of me. No. I got you. Okay, why? Well, what did I do? Well, Just right, ask you to restroom? I have to put the restroom order on you. Yeah, there you go. Sorry. Good. Yeah. Yep. Here. Put her on the ground. I'm just going to pop her on this. Would you stop? Seriously? Because 
real quick. I just have to pee. Can I please pee? You just kick me? Can I pee? Oh, what are you doing? I'm just kidding. Okay, can you use the restroom? Sir, will you walk me to the restroom? You're under arrest. That's definitely not happening. So she doesn't try to slip on me. Now you're going me. to jail for f***ing battery on Elio. Stop squirming. I just want to use the restroom. <laughs> Seven five five dispatch. We got one ten fifteen. Stop kicking. Let me use the restroom. You will when you get to go to jail. and you're under arrest for battery on LEO now. We're gonna um, just have you write a statement to about the previous incident and then, what's that? I'm gonna use the restroom. Yeah, I'm gonna use the restroom. Ah. Seriously. Yes sir, no worries. Despite staying in a critical situation, Autumn continued her unsteady behavior. As a result, she soon faced the consequences of her disruptiveness. Why are you doing this? Because you can't behave right now. Oh, I was just going to go to the restroom. You guys are most disgusting. Yeah. yeah. with trespassing an occupied structure, resisting an officer with violence, and battery on an officer. Now, let's see someone who engaged in a shootout with law enforcement. I'm not trespassing. You are. I've told you you're trespassing. If I move more than three steps, they're kidnapped. The incident is centered around a man named Michael John Applin on the 7th of June, 2023 in Olympia, Washington. The officers responded to private property after a report of a man trespassing. Henceforth, they didn't waste any time inspecting. Upon reaching the location, the police instantly encountered John. The authorities displayed patience, but things significantly changed at one point and a notable change was visible in their demeanor. Let's get out of here, the same, same plates to work. 
taken off of my truck were on the red truck. Imagine that. What's your name, my man? I don't wish to enter business with you. Okay, then get out of here. LLC and all. So, so you're trespassed, so you got to go. I can't be trespassed because I own all the apples. This is my state. <laughs> so, you're trespassed. Just so you know, you're being audio and video recorded. I know. If you don't. PDR? Yeah, it's a wonderful thing. Thank you, Obama. Okay. So, if you don't leave, you'll that be arrested for trespass. Watkins? Yep. Yeah. All Lou and all. Good to see you. I guess uh, that's a hate crime as well. Okay. Thank you. So, you can choose to leave. If not, you're going to go to jail for trespass. I'm not going to jail for trespass. I'm going to die here. Because I'm not going back as well. Okay, then why don't you just leave? I was at businesses right next to the OPD today, cleaning up all the trash out of the swamp. Yeah. Yep. When I graduated drug court, yeah. How long ago was that? Didn't graduate. I failed. How long were you in drug court for, though? I... Roughly 30 months. How long ago? Like, this year, last year? Uh, no. No? Same time I filed the class action lawsuit against Guam. Who's that? Kiwanis. Kiwan, like the Kiwanis Club? Uh, Circle K. Yeah, like the Kiwanis Club? Yep. Okay. And when was that? So what's the deal with UGM today? Uh, today? Yeah. Like what's going on? Like why? What, like what's going on? Like why? Why stay here? Why stay here? When you're trespassing now. I'm not trespassing. You are. I've told you you're trespassing. If I move more than three steps, they're kidnapped. How's that kidnapping? You make somebody move more than three steps against their will, that's called kidnapping. It's not that. Yeah, that. Okay. That lawyer. What lawyer? Michael Carr. Never heard of him. <laughs> you have now. I guess. Last action lawsuit. For what? Everything. Okay. Yeah. That much money. <laughs> you I know mean, just using my name got five hundred thousand dollars fine. You wish to enter business with me? No. Not really. So I'll put a lien on everything you own. Okay. And sell it for pennies to a third world country. I guess it's donating? You can call that. Okay. Is there a reason you don't want to leave? No. You just don't want to leave? I was just born here. I'm a Cherokee native and all. Well, since you don't want to leave, you're under arrest for trespassing. Why don't you go ahead and sit down for me? I'm not trespassing. I you're own. under arrest for trespassing, so that means you're not. Well, I guess I go like point, die so. today, huh? Okay. You want to sit down so we can handle this civilly? No, I'm going to actually shoot you. If you have a dude, if you pull a gun, you're going to get shot. I know. Okay, Why don't you guys leave, please? Everybody stay out of the way. 3663. He's saying we'll have to shoot him. Okay, clear out. Get down on the ground now. So you better get another cop down here. Get down on the ground. Hey! Get out of there! You guys need to move! Go! All of you move! Now! Guys, go! Get out of there! Move! Yeah, I might want to listen to him. Because we have him at gunpoint, you need to move. Thank you. Get on the ground or you're going to get shot with a pepper ball or a 40 millimeter round. If you pull a gun, you're going to get shot. Since he was adamant about his obstinate nature, the cop's action went to another level and the entire scenario turned into chaos. Off probation for the first time in my life. Completed yeah. Stood in front of bullets to save a woman's life. Yeah. It took him 32 minutes to come in and get me. Hmm. Weird. 
Get on the ground. Get on the ground or force is being used against you. This is your last warning. Get on the ground. Get on the ground or force is being used against you. Stay inside. I know that. Now remember, PDR, chest cam, gas cam, all that. Yeah? You're welcome. Can you just get on the ground and listen, please? It's going to be easier for everybody. Nobody wants you to get hurt, my man. Nobody wants you to get hurt. How are we going to end this? You need to get on the ground. We're not doing it that way, my man. No one's going to get hurt. Okay. We can talk about that later. But right now, we're going to secure you. That way, this doesn't need to escalate. All right. It's your last chance to get on the ground. You're going to get hit with some less lethal. Force is going to be used against you, so get down on the ground. Show us your hands. Take your hand out from behind your shirt, empty, and put them on top of your head. If you continue to not comply, force is going to be used against you. Get off the ground now. Get on the ground now. Let's go to 40. Go to 40. Get on the ground now. Get on the ground. Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground now! Get on the ground! 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 Get on Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it. Get Alex, back down. What's up? You take over. Go. No. Okay. I don't know whose it is. Sit up. Right. Sit up. So. <laughs> He's just going. Sit up. Thanks for kidnapping me. <laughs> I appreciate it. He's refusing to move. So he's refusing to move. <laughs> what? Refusing to move. We're gonna do a wrap. Okay, I already got it. Okay, but um, we got move. fire coming with all. You the shot me in the okay. place I've been shot before. I can't move. You, want that back? you probably just severed the. <laughs> I have a piece of shrap. I have a piece of shrapnel in my sciatic nerve. So you probably just. Do we want to wrap him up. Finish it. Let him just be their choice. I said we wait for fire. Wait for fire. Yeah, well, why don't you just help keep the crowd back? <laughs> what? 40, I think. Mike had it. Mike has it. Oh. Sir, you need to back up and let us do our job. You need to go back or you'll be arrested for obstruction. Step back. Do you want to sit up, my man? Or you want to just keep laying there? Um, I think uh, you just finished my sciatic nerve. Because okay. I had a uh, piece of shrapnel in it. I was losing my legs. They told me I'd never walk again when I was in the hospital. Okay. Well, you're going to get checked out by fire. <coughs> and you're going to go get checked out at the hospital. Thank you. You're welcome. Why did we have to take it this far, my man? Because you're a domestic <laughs> Okay. Thank you for taking 32 minutes for the fire department to get into the jungle to save my life, too. Hey, will you move a car up into this parking lot? Yeah. Sir, I'm the sergeant on scene. Will you talk to me about what happened today? Sure. Okay. What would you like to tell me? <laughs> I don't wish to your business with it. Okay, so you don't want to talk to me. Understood. Can I take pictures of your injuries? To use anything on me, my body, or my name is a $500,000 fine. You wish to enter business with me? So am I not allowed to lift your shirt to take a photo? Yeah, he's got one right on the stomach, so we're moving. You've already kidnapped me. How can I help you, sir? We just need to roll him onto this. Thanks for killing me and cat kidnapping me again. <coughs> Appreciate it, Gary. John's peculiar behavior notwithstanding, the officers remained steadfast in their duties, unfazed as they continued with their following line of action. It's like a bag of meth that's in my car that's in my name. Yep. You're welcome, my car. Family's dead, don't even know it. Yep.
He just needs to be clipped in on the other side. Okay. You gotta tighten these yeah. ones too. Yeah, that's good. Got that set? No, not yet. Ready? <coughs> I'm going to the other side. Frank, can you grab my legs? We're working on it. I did. A long time ago. Okay, I can't get through. So you got him? Where do you hurt so I can tell the fire department? Everywhere. Okay. Yeah, check the back of your trophy because there's a toilet bowl and a bowl of. Ow! Ow! What hurts? Yeah. You just dropped the handcuffs. What do you think, Larry? Alright, is your ankle the only one that hurts? Where do you hurt at, bud? Hey, man. No, this is the fire department. I'm trying to check you out medically. It's okay. Don't worry about it. You're alright? You don't have any pain anywhere? I'm in pain everywhere. Okay, where does it hurt the most? From head to toe. Okay. I'm going right. to get a blood so pressure. So is there one area that hurts more than from head to toe? More towards the head than the toe? Or the... You're going to name this stuff for him. Okay. Well, I'm just going to lift it. My sciatic nerve is probably severed. Okay. Yeah. I right. had a piece of shrapnel that was cutting it in half. I was losing my leg. Okay. Oh, okay. I was shot <laughs> saving a man of Fontaine in the jungle, remember? No. It took you guys a half hour to come and get the nuts to oh, come sorry. and get me. Okay. Remember well, now? Well, that's because it's dangerous in there, man. That's why. It ain't dangerous in there. Oh, you don't think so? Uh, no. <laughs> but yeah, you. It ain't any dangerous, more dangerous in there than it is out here on the street. Any god. <laughs> yeah, well, we just have a job, man. We don't want to go in and get hurt. Hey, what's your first name? So f get behind a desk then. Hey, I am. <laughs> what's your first name? Owner. Owner? What's your last name, owner? Ireland. Owner Ireland. Do you have any medical history, bud? A mile long. Okay, give me your top four. My top four? Yep. Shot, 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 and shot. Okay, so you've been shot a couple times. How about any medical stuff like diabetes, heart problems, seizures? Uh, No, it'll burn. Okay, we're gonna put you back in the car. Mm -hmm. Another side. You want to do it lightly this time? Ready? One, two, three. <coughs> can I lay down? Uh, you can try. Can I turn on my side at least? Thank you. Okay, yeah, close the door. That's called yeah. uh, OC <laughs> pellet ball. Oh, and <laughs> me. Cops are raping me. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Thank you. Now I own everything you own. Like I'm a so. native. In the <laughs> <laughs> Born in Olympia. I did a pat down here. You're raping me. <laughs> Stop raping me. I don't wish to enter business with you! Test cam! Video cam only! PDR! Well, I don't know Thank you! What? You're welcome. Okay. No, you guys just all lost your job. Alright. Hurt. Violation of everything. It's called right. They, they made me move more than three steps as well. That's called side. kidnapping. They're domestic terrorists. <laughs> yeah, I was sold to a farmer. <laughs> Like seven <laughs> women put my head down and ride it. So we That's awesome. Why aren't we doing this? Why are we doing soft? Michael John Applin was charged with criminal trespass and resisting arrest. While John showed the ultimate belligerency by confronting the cops, let's see someone who tried to show overconfidence after trespassing on school grounds and it completely backfired. Yeah, no, I ain't going to jail. At all, not out here. I don't live out here. I'm not from here. The incident is centered around a 30 years old man named Michael Shan Curtis Jr. On the 13th of January, 2024, in Palm Coast, Flagler County, Florida, the officers responded to a call after they received news about someone trespassing on school grounds. The officer entered the main entrance and located Sean. 
Soon, the deputy issued him an order and didn't hesitate to act, which went with the flow of the law. Seemingly, Shan was not a person to admit his misdeed. What's going on? Visiting one of my schools, man. Visiting one of your schools? Yes. Do you know you're on school property right now? I do. I've got family that goes to school here. Okay. That doesn't mean you can I, come here. I don't live far from here. I'm able to get, I'm able to come here. Okay. You stand up for me? Yeah, I stand up for you. You turn around and face away from me? Yeah, I'm facing. All right. Just put your hands behind your back. Yeah. Am I in trouble? I'm going to detain you for right now, okay? Okay. I was just visiting the football field. Okay. I see somebody working. I ain't got you. I didn't know we couldn't come out here and have that right now. No, you ain't locking me up for coming I'm out here to play you. football. I'm not locking you up right now. I'm just detained right now, okay? You're just a tank. All right. Oh, some man just called the police out on the football field. Sit down for me. Yeah. All I was doing is coming to that scene. Y'all had a football field. I didn't know if play on it or not. I got some new J's for Christmas. So I wanted to know if I shoot ball out here or whatever. Just. One detain at this time. All right, so so what are you doing? What are you doing? I was coming to see y'all. Seen y'all had a football field. I was walking down the highway and I seen us see if I could start playing football, man. That's ten I seen a guy out there jogging on the field. Is that a problem? Ten forty-five hours. Okay. I didn't know this wasn't illegal to do that. All right, but you're trespassing on school property. I'm not trying to trespass on the school property. I'm, I was asking, is the football field available for us to play football on? Okay. Without saying Leroy's back in town. Who? You know what I'm saying? Without a shirt missing. All I was saying is it okay for me to go to the football field and sit down at least. Okay. Do you have anything on you right now? I ain't got nothing on me. You have ID? I've got ID. And I've been I've already been dropped off by the sheriff down this way at the store. I was just he's the one that gave me a ride down this way. I just passed it. I the only reason I passed this football field on the street, uh -huh. I was just making sure I, I mean, if you don't allow, if you don't allow, I'll get off property. That's what I came here for. Okay. I seen one guy there with a flag that's jogging, that's black. Hey, calm down. Listen, I was in there, okay? I calm graduated down. military school. I graduated, I'll college, uh, all that stuff. You need to calm down. Okay, I'm not trying to, but I mean, I was just, just asking. Just calm down right now, okay? Do uh, y'all allow football in the field? What does, that's football, what I was what does football have to do with you I seen one, being I seen on one being right athletic. Here. I seen one out there uh, playing basketball or whatever. I, football is what I was saying. I haven't, I haven't played football in a while. I was want to know if it was able to rock and run the track with him without getting in trouble. So what makes it okay for you to come on school property? Well, I seen him doing it. He was old enough. To, I mean, I didn't know. I just seen one out there working out on the field. I didn't know if, I, if it was if it was not. If, I mean, is it illegal to work out on the field? Did you remember that? Yet? Not yet. Hey, I got a few questions for you. Yeah. But I do have reason this thing off my little car first before we go any further. Yeah. That's it. Right. Calm down. Yeah, I'm fine. I know I ain't getting locked up. I'm going to jail. Calm down. Relax. Batch number 875. Anyways, this is in regards to the All I was doing was just checking the football field to see if I can work out on it, man. That's okay. all I was doing. Okay. If you want me to leave this property, I'm goes yeah. by that too. Relax. Relax. I'm a grown man. Got kids Calm down. House. Relax. Let me read you something real quick. Can I read you your ritual? Yeah. Before we go any further? Anyways, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say may be used as evidence against you. You have the right to talk to an attorney and have them work with you. I don't need an attorney. Any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, we want to be a part of representation. Well, he's asking for the field, man. Talking or have an attorney present. All questioning, we stop and do request. Do you understand these rights? Yes, I do. All right. But all I was doing was asking, is this field? I know I'm not, not trying to trespass, but I mean, is the field available and y'all can just let me walk the f back home? Do you have and a I, driver's license already? I have ID. Y'all can run my name and my background and let me loose over football, over just checking to see if the well, football field. Where's your ID at? I don't have one on me. I don't have one. I don't buy. You can ring by name. By name. Uh, yeah. yeah. I know I ain't going to jail over checking to see if this is running football. You go with it? Yeah, I'm good. All right, brother. What's your first name? Uh, Michael Shane Curtis Jr. First name is what? Michael? Michael Shane Curtis Jr. Yeah. Michael? Shane Curtis Jr. Spell your last name? Uh, C U R T I S. C R? C U R T I S. C U R? T I S. T I S. Curtis? Yeah, to uh, and uh, social. What is your, you have middle name? Yeah, I got one. What is it? Shane. I just told you, S H A N E. You, you gotta calm down. I am. You're going too fast, okay? Okay. So your name is Michael Curtis? Yeah. Middle name is Shane. Yeah. Okay. What's your date of birth?
but that's all I was really doing is I seen, I mean, I seen nobody out there on the field, man. The flag, okay. It's cold out there, man. It's freezing cold. I'm not not no play out there. I was just want to know you. is it available without trespassing or doing what I'm doing right now. And your ID's out of Florida? Yeah, I got an ID out of Florida and I got a vital license. Despite the cop's repeated attempts to make him understand, his point of view remained unchanged. He stuck with his argumentative nature. Dog run, Job get out on the field, do something back, <laughs> get, off the, get, get off the road or wherever I was. Okay, wh where are you coming from? Uh, uh, well, I've, I've got, I've got, I've got, I live in Fort Lauderdale, I have three homes in Fort Lauderdale, I've got a house in Putnam and I got one out in uh, Citrus. Uh-huh. So, I mean, I was coming from Putnam, not from Citrus over here, to, uh, from I-10. Uh, so, where'd you originally come from before you came here? Uh, from Putnam. Putnam? Yeah. So, you came from Putnam? Yeah. Right? You walked over here or how'd you yeah, go? I, I got a ride from the office, another officer. He dropped me off at the store and uh, he just said to me, he told me, he said, you're trying to make it. I said, yeah, did you make it? He said, if you all make it, if you walk, and I said, yeah. And so I started walking down this road and I was like, my feet are hurting. My feet are hurting. My feet are really blistered up and really hurting. Mm -hmm. and so the Do you need any medical attention? Well, my feet really hurt real bad. So, I mean, that could be why I'm on school property. That's why, because I got lazy and my feet real tight. I didn't want to, I didn't want to cock down. You didn't want to keep walking? I didn't want to keep walking without a water bottle. I didn't have no water. Okay. And just that man right there, I mean, just tell him all he was trying to do was go on the football field. I'm not, but, I don't even know nobody at this school. But Before you keep interrupting me by telling you I was out of water without walking, mm -hmm. and I'm here for a football field, I was laying down, my head could have cracked. I could have been, you, you got handcuffs on me. My head could probably be bleeding to death without walking, without shoes or injury. I mean, do you understand? I was just here to get to check the football field and see if I could work out on it, man. See if I could still play football again someday. About being racist, but black, that doesn't get you the right to walk on school property. Though. It doesn't, but it does. Didn't you know this is a private property? I didn't know if it wasn't my old high school, man. I got the hell on somewhere. How about that? What'd you go to high school at? I went to Louisville High School. Uh, graduated uh, Louisville High School with GED, with diploma, with a uh, full fledged, with high school diploma. <laughs> And military school. I graduated military school. I staff sergeant, all that stuff. Three five two eleven two fifteen south check. We gone everything. The only thing is, I mean, I mean, I've got ID and all that. I got dropped off by another officer. I wouldn't go and bring no hot dogs. I seen the fire truck. I didn't know if y'all had some hot dogs. I got dollars in my pocket. I didn't know. And that too, I thought I seen a food truck up here that year, just in case they had nachos or hot dogs, because I seen the fire truck. So that was another reason why too. I didn't know if they were selling hot dogs. Okay. Just sit tight for me. I'm gonna run your name real quick. Thank yeah, you. Your name is Michael Curtis. Yeah, but I'm not going to jail over that, am I? I gotta run you real quick, okay? We're all right. an investigation right now, all right? I don't have one. I all just right. got dropped out of four officers in three different times and ran my name and ain't got one. Okay. Just sit tight. Yeah. But this is and your last name is Curtis. Yes. Yeah, C U R T I S. Yeah. Okay. And no, you may not run out of Florida. You have to run it eventually out of Oklahoma. You have to run my name out of Oklahoma. Oklahoma? Long Oklahoma, because if it ends up in, Bravo, it it ends up out of Georgia, it, it, I ain't from Florida now. Copy one out of Florida by number for 27, 28P. I lied in Montgomery or Georgia. How about that? My name or number? By name. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. First name Michael, common spelling, last name Curtis, common spelling, middle name Shane, date of birth, 1048. All right. I'm glad I'm not in no trouble, but yeah, that's really what I was going to get off the I seen the fire truck as I was walking past the hills mm -hmm. up before I entered, and I thought there was a hot dog stand. I got money on me. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I got like two or three dollars and give me, I'd give me a hot dog or something. I didn't know if they still so, sold Why were you pulling on door handles? I wasn't. I was trying to see if they see if they had had a drink machine or something like that, and see if they had the hot dog or something. Like I was gonna give it. I was gonna give a machine so that way I could go, I could go out to the football field and go and go straight to straight. I just told you what I was here for. Okay. I mean, oh man, I'm not. I'm not here to play games around your school. I'm just here for the. I'm just here. To, I was here to see if you the football field and had some some hot dogs or something that I could fill myself up on because I was far out. You know what I mean? I was out of the way. I, I'm not here for this school. I'm not here for you to pull about six deep on me, man. I got you. Okay. I mean, am I, can you take me out of this and get off property? Just right now. Doing an investigation right now, so you gotta sit tight. There ain't no investigation, sir. I just got off this school. I'm not even from you. You just ran my name. I just told you what I was here for. I don't know who you are. You know who I am, okay? 
I just ran you real quick. I'm trying to find out. I've been running them all day. I know I ain't from this town. I ain't from this county. You got all my information about that new dashboard, man. Okay. I know I ain't doing nothing, but that's really what I was here for. The football field and to get a hot dog. I was in the fire truck, man. I was walking. Seemingly, law enforcement was almost done with his unnecessary arguments. Perhaps he was overconfident, and sadly, his attempt failed badly. No, you got to run my name out of Oklahoma. Out of Oklahoma, but you told me out of Florida at first. Yeah, you got to run it out of Oklahoma because I ain't allowed in Georgia and uh, Alabama. Okay. I ain't allowed in Georgia or Alabama. That's why you got to run it out of Oklahoma. Okay. Hold And you say you were dropped off? By another officer. Where, uh, where were you dropped not off? Not too far. It wasn't it was too far from here at all. 211. Mm-hmm. 1029 PS 1054. He's on Florida MA release status reference. Aggravated assault with a weapon. No intent to kill. 10 more. All right. So where would you get dropped off at? I got dropped off by another officer. Where at? At the gas station on I-10. On I-10? Yeah, I, it, was, it was back there at the highway. He dropped me off. He dropped you off? Yeah, another officer. And you walked from where? He ran my background, dropped me off, all that stuff. Uh, and I walked, I was just walking by here and I seen the fire truck and I was thirsty. And you were thirsty? Yeah, I was gonna play on the football field or something. That's yeah, it. Yeah, the football field? Yeah. Where do you live at? Where do you live with? Uh, I don't have to tell you who I live and who I live with. I'm a grown man. Okay. Any reason why you were trying to do anything? I wasn't. I was, I was. I seen the fire truck and I was looking for it. I thought y'all had a concession in our football game going. I was going to grab that hot dog. And I seen the football. And I seen a couple grown ups out there on the football field that were here. I didn't know if I was in cause any trouble that I seen. I would be able to go out there and sit at it. So all I was trying to do was get off the streets and get off the highway before I got hit or ran over. Instead of being picky and blind about the stuff or being illusionist about anything about any of that story. Without saying, yeah, without saying Minnesota or uh, Philadelphia, I mean, I know it's snowing out in, uh, up north maybe, but I know it's cold, not far, but it does cold all the time. My mom was from Miami and Fort Lauderdale, and I have Kentro and Cartel in my family and in my blood. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, other than that, I mean, as far as something go, I mean, from here to the store, another officer dropped me off, and I was just walking by and seeing the fire truck. I seen the fire truck. Another officer down the road too. Was over there off the bottom, right down the road at the gas station on I ten. He <laughs> just dropped. He just another officer just so dropped from north. From, from that gas station, just dropped me off. Walked over here. Now you're here. <laughs> so you walked from like St. Augustine all the way to the From St. Augustine, yeah. From Put- he, dro- he picked me up from Putnam. Put- walked from St. Augustine to I ten. And I walked from I ten back from the gas station from here. That's what it is. Okay. And the only reason I'm able to, because I mean, I've got, I've got, I've got Marine in my, I got, I got a Marine, I got, I got a brother, uh, I got an uncle that graduated in the Marine, I got an uh, uncle, a uh, grandpa that graduated in the Navy, and uh, I got a daddy that uh, is in the Marine Center Outlaws. Do you have any uh, family here, Yeah, I got, I've got, I've got, I've got, I've got, I've got another uncle that's in the Marines, and uh, so. I'm, do you have family in the area? Yeah, I, I do not have family in the area, but I'm, I'm trying, I was trying to get back to Panama City, and I just ended up way out here, man. Straight up, man. Like, I, like, way high. I was just like, man, I, I grabbed the feels like. I got you. Okay. So, look, I know this isn't your first run. I need to run your criminal check real quick. Sure. So, let's get you in the back of the car so we're not here out in the cold. Yeah, I just know I'm not going to jail or nothing like that, right? At this point, we have determined. Is that yours? That's cool. This is. This is. Yeah. Nah, yeah. no, I thought it was a joke. It was a long five. But yeah, that was awesome. I didn't know. I was, I, all I'll do is, uh, so Putnam came and dropped me yeah, off. Yeah, they dropped me off down at the gas station right there. All of a sudden, I see the fire truck was getting like, uh, I thought I had a ball gangle. Yeah. So, I mean, uh, I probably won't go to jail for that. All right. Before we get in, my partner is going to fetch it. Do you want this to go with you? Yeah, I just want to know. I just want to let you know I'm not going to jail for, for what I just told you, man. What? You don't have to put that in your You don't have to put right that in That's all I'm saying. I was getting off the highway. Right. I live, right. I, I do not live far from here, is what right. I'm saying. Let's special down real quick. Yeah. You have any weapons on you? I don't have anything on me, man. I don't got no wallet or nothing. You just wear my name. So why would I go to jail? 
Right now, we still have to run a criminal history. Uh, that takes a little bit. Why? Right, so my criminal Just history. Just turn around. All right, I won't be going. Spread your feet apart. Spread your feet apart. Spread your feet apart. There you go. All right. Where did you get the piece of insulation? Uh, that was actually with off the damage of the phone. Cool. But be careful my back and my ankles. They hurt. they hurt right now? Yeah. Okay. How bad do they hurt? They hurt, man. I've been walking on them, man. That's what I'm saying. I could have been dehydrating on them. I ain't got nothing on me, man. Just making sure, okay? Yeah, you good. All right. Yeah, I know I ain't going to jail. Right, well, At all. Not out here. I don't live out here. I'm not from here. Michael Shan Curtis Jr. was arrested for trespassing. Now let's see somebody who showed utter defiance against the authorities, but it didn't work at all. I'm worried about my wife. I'm, 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 I'm talking to her. I'm gonna tell her what's going on. We're gonna take care of her. Are you gonna be quiet and let us tell you something? Yes, man. Okay. The incident is centered around a male. On the 2nd of February, 2024, in Washington, the deputies were dispatched to a local McDonald's parking lot after receiving the report of an unwanted person camping inside a van. The police instantly engaged with the suspect, issued him a directive, and didn't hesitate to act fiercely that matched the law and his misdeeds. Despite the suspect's vehement effort, his fate was already sealed. Portons of police. You guys, uh, you just open that door over there so we can talk? You guys open up the door. Hey, don't close the door. No, I'm not closing it. What's going on? What yeah. the I let you know that going on to me? So, you guys can't camp here. You guys can't sleep here. Okay, okay that's pretty much it. Y'all can just be, hey, guys, y'all can move. Y'all can get, I'm gonna got this what doing right now. What are y'all doing? What the is going on? We're telling you that you can't move here. Okay, that you gotta move along. Okay? I can get out of here, but there's no need to. Open the Oh, we weren't like that, we're just saying to open up. Okay? Oh no. Because we were told that somebody, an employee, tried to contact you already, but they, you wouldn't wake up for him. Where? Okay. Where? Who, who, come, who came to come and talk to us? As we were told, an employee like kept trying to talk to you, alright? Why, why can't we park here? Because we're wow. nearly driving all day. I'm okay. trying to rest a little this bit. This is a private business, and they don't want you to camp here. Plain and simple, okay? They have the right to do I that. I know, I know, definitely, right? Okay. But like, again, okay. why the f I have to come out here with that flashlight and that over here flashing at me. And if you know I'm camping, what the do y'all have to put flashlight okay. at me? Because I don't know you. We don't, don't know the situation. We want to stay safe, all right? You can read it. Okay. Right? It says my legally is my name, right? Okay. What is your name? In my license plate. You got ID on you? You got a right license plate. I don't have to identify me because you're yes, you not tell me. You do have no, to identify no, yourself. Have, let me go change me and I'll get moved out of here, okay? No. Do not close that door. Hey. Hey. Step on out. Get out. Hey. Step Get on out. out. Step you're out. being detained right now. Step Why on out. Step detained? out. Because hey. you're trespassing, no, and I'm now not. you're obstructing hey. by I'm slamming I'm the door. I'm trying to get out. Step I'm out. trying to get out. You just need to get in. Step out. Sir, do not do that. Do not do that because I'm telling you, you're going to get a lawsuit. Step hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. What's going on? Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on your knees. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Get on your knees. Sir. Get on the ground. Hey, Let's go. Hey, I'm pulling my hand behind my back. No, I'm not resisting. No, I'm not resisting. I'm Get on the look. ground then. Hey, look at my, oh, my mama and my boxers. Come on. What the f guys? Are you serious treating me like this? Stay right there. Are you serious treating me like this? Man, I want you supervisor, yeah. man. No, I want you supervisor. This is not right, man. Y'all treating me, pulling me out, man, and saying I'm resisting. I'm not right. doing nothing, man. I'm just pissed out. You woke me up and I'm. I'm just working on the end, man. What's the hey, is this, man? Put your legs out. Man, I'm Lay like, flat on the ground right I, now. How can Lay I do flat that? on the ground. Hey, how can I do that when you have weight on me? Okay. Lean Kick. forward. There, there you go. go. Man, why are you doing this, guys? I'm just sleeping, trying to work hey, all stop. day, man. Stop. Stop resisting. I'm not even resisting. Yes, you are. No, I am not. Right now, you're under arrest for obstruction and trespassing. My father's are Why are hey, you doing stop. No, man. This is not right. All oh, we were going to try and do is wake you up and have you move somewhere you I can I was going to do it, but you're all here. But you were being that. aggressive. No, not I'm not. Man. No, I was not. And then we told you I to close the door, and you did. That's obstruction. Well, you're under arrest. Guys. So how can I? Hey, I'm in my underwear. Yeah, I'm in my underwear. I need to talk to you. Is this yours or his? My right, wife could have been underwear, roll, man. Roll towards no, me. Stop, man. What the f***, man? This is f***ing yeah. up there, man. So you're going to stand up. All right, ready? Put him in your car. One, two, three, stand up. Please, officer, I'm not even. 
<laughs> My wife can let me drive. Obviously, obviously, you're being so aggressive. Honestly, he was not even going to. I had a chance. Look at me. Look how you got me. Come on. This is not even obstruction of nothing. They didn't even warn me nothing. You cannot even uh, trespass. He told you not no, to close the not. door and you slammed it in his oh, face. Look at me. Look at me. Oh, I'm going to come. My wife could have been too. You have to understand how I'm going to move if you're not going to give me an option to even move. I need to talk to the officer. You could have just died. You could have not used to pull me out like that. Honestly, there was no What's need to. What's your feet in? Officer, please. My wife can let you drive. She can let you drive. Officer. Turn away from me. Listen to me. I'll talk to you in a second. Turn away from me. Look that way. This for sleeping, man. This is not fair. I'll talk to you in a second. Well, we talked to the employee here. And no, this is nothing. A... Every she coming, nothing. I, I... Okay. I cool, uh, yeah. um, well, that's what we were trying to figure out and talk to him about, but he didn't want to cooperate. Sorry. <laughs> okay. The police learned of the malpractice of the suspect from a McDonald's employee. Later, the deputy stated that the perpetrator was responsible for his delinquency, which seemed to baffle him. I have no idea. Okay. I just have so you came out, I knocked on the out. window. Did they, like... Roll around. The window, um, Did they look at you or anything? Or? No, no, he couldn't get them to wake up. They were okay. dead asleep. Couldn't get them to wake up. They were sleeping. Okay. I just, I wish it didn't happen like that. I just wanted them to move their car. Well, well, he yelling and cussing at us, and we just tried to get his name no, I get, I get so we could figure it all out, and then he tried to slam the door on us. Yeah. I mean, if there was nobody in there, I was just gonna leave a note on the. Yeah. Window. Yeah. You First off, what's your name? What's your name? Alright, so I'm gonna read you your Miranda rights, okay? Why are you gonna give me an officer? Hey, please? Mira, Mira, I'm gonna read you your Miranda rights, okay? Sir, sir, please leave me. Why are we getting arrested? I'm please. not even with me. I will explain to you once I read your Miranda, okay? Officer, it's getting my own. So listen, my wife you, have the right, you have the right to remain silent. Officer, to hold on. Listen, off. hey, hey. Listen, I'm listen. This we'll, guy doesn't make no sense. We'll talk. No warning, no nothing. We'll no talk. Makes no sense. He needs to tell you this and then we can talk, okay? Wait, I'm getting arrested. My wife is right here. No, she can't drive. We can try nothing. in a second if you want to try over. Let him calm down. We'll be back when you're ready to talk, okay? I am. I am. Are you going to be quiet? I'm worried about my wife. I'm, 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 I'm talking to her. I'm going to tell her what's going on. We're going to take care of her. Are you going to be quiet and let us tell you something? Yes, man. Okay. Right. Read your Miranda warning, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in the court of law. So, the reason why we're here is because we were called about you guys sleeping here, okay? Officer, I Officer, worked Hey, let me talk for a second, okay? We were here because y'all were camping here, and we were just going to come here to tell you to move along, okay? That was what I was going to do. I, I had okay. to close hey, the door. Mira, Look at mira, me. mira. When I approached you, okay, I, know, I was, I, I hey, it, hey, 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 I, I was it. not disrespectful to you. I get it, yes, I, I know. was simply going to tell you. I know. I you guys know. can move along or I know. I know, you guys will be sure. trespassing and go to jail, okay? Yes, definitely, but you have okay. to understand that I was my boxer. I was My wife is sometimes even that's, okay. my, that's being disrespectful to my house. That's my home. Okay. I'm homeless. You guys live there? Yes, that's. I'm homeless. Okay. I work all day doing deliveries. Where you guys all from? I do. I'm from. That's okay. my area. What y'all doing over here? I, like I said again, I do deliveries all day, all day. I do roadie. So technically I deliver, I deliver all day, okay. all day. I don't stop doing it. And, and when I come here, I buy a soda and something and I came to park. That's pretty much what I do. Okay. And sleep. And right now, because like I said, you y'all woke me up and like I said, I don't do nothing. I don't even, I don't know why they say I'm camping because I'm just parked okay. here a couple of hours and I leave even. So I'm not even thing. here so, for hey, hey. so that is camping, okay? Oh, uh, well, definitely. So I'm there are, say. so there, if you didn't know, you can go to the, the, out to the fairgrounds and you can stay there. No one will bother you, okay? Nobody would have told us. And I'll be honest, okay. to be honest, he, nobody came to, to the woman to say, hey, you have to move. Nobody. Okay. Nobody gave us a warning to say you're trespassing. Nobody. Okay. Nobody came to us at this point. Like, yeah, the first one, and like I said, I got woke up out of nowhere, and okay. to be, be well, let me, with let me ask, let me ask, hey, let me ask you this, okay? 
late at night, do you think private businesses want you sleeping in their parking lot? Probably not, but okay. if, like I said, if I buy some, if I bought something, it's kind of fair square. They say I bought something. That's why I was here. Well, if that is the case, that even then they still have the right. To tell you not to be there, okay? No, definitely, definitely. So you said that you're the only one that can drive the vehicle? Yes. Okay. Does she not have a license? No. Okay. Gotcha. And were you guys planning on meeting somebody over here in a couple hours? No, officer. I okay. was just got, sleeping. Okay. We were just about right. to I'm just asking. Oh, we're just clear, trying to clarify the story, okay? I don't understand why you're thinking if I'm doing a drug dealer or drug hey, stuff, no, man. Hey, did I say that? I didn't well, say you're, that. you're telling me if I'm going to meet somebody, no. I told you a couple minutes ago, okay. you're here to sleep and rest. Okay, and that's what I'm trying to clear up. Y'all okay. trying to make me drive. Y'all want me to drive to all sleeping and all everything. No, I, I I understand your intention. But However, thing. when two, when employees start knocking on your door, on your window, Nobody knocked them like on. two different employees said they did, okay? <laughs> If somebody's leaving it's for a reason, not because it wants to camp. It's not always about. It's all about being homeless. And I'm trying to get out of homeless. And right, okay. good thing this is. This is gonna help my refugee case. I eventually, this is this is what y'all did to me. It's very unfairful. Hey. And I even think about it right now. Like you weren't trying me to. Despite the cops' repeated attempts to make him understand, the suspect's nature remained unswayed. They close the door, right? But then you're like, don't close the door. It makes no reasonable to you be acting like that at this point. And then for the other guy just to literally drive my open and drag me out of my car, my car without even, like I said, I'll be honest with you, I encounter officers like this, and I literally just tell him, that's my name, this, this, and that's it. Okay. But y'all just went to the stream, pulled me out, dragged me, and literally say on your camera saying, you're resisting, when I was not even resisting, put him, my hands were behind me. Like literally y'all were even ready to shoot me with a taser. Without no explanation of just, I'm no, I'm no harm, I'm no danger, I'm no nothing. But y'all literally action, literally were against me like a f criminal if y'all had like, if I had like a gun or something. It makes no sense. But like I said, this is gonna help my refugee case because eventually this is what y'all did to me. Even right now, like this, in my boxer, expose me on my, on you're my. You're saying deck. refugee case? What do you mean? I'm a refugee. From where? From the United States. I'm a refugee. You're and like saying I said, you're in this, the United States, right? Well, yeah, I know. I'm okay. a refugee of the United States. That's why I am. I'm from Mexico and I'm a refugee here. Okay. So you're okay. a refugee from Mexico. Yeah. You will be going to jail for obstruction, okay? Why? Are there clothes in there that you want? Why am I being in? <laughs> Definitely, because y'all dragged me out without clothes. I need clothes. Okay. Alright. Uh, where are they at in the vehicle? I don't know. Like, I took it off and put it over there. You can ask my okay. girlfriend, but... Alright. Why am I... Please, officer, I need to talk to the supervisor or somebody, because this is not fair, man. I'm working all day, and then for me to get this, man, okay. like, literally makes no sense, man. And like, just because I have a little bit added to y'all went over your bad man okay. like honestly this, so like i said before this ptsd that y'all y'all literally just treating me like this shit, man this is gonna help me out so bad because y'all just literally went at me without right. no reason so here's the deal I, I so you PTSD. will be going to jail for obstruction we're trying to get your your wife girlfriend you said girlfriend just now my girlfriend my wife everything right. so we're trying to get your lady a hotel room for the night Okay. Where's my car? You will see a judge at 1.15 tomorrow if you don't bail out by then, okay? So you guys will be able to f*** up. Then, Why? Okay? This is unfair, man. This is so f***ing unfair, man. Like, honestly, this makes no sense, man. Okay. Just for resting and working, man. Where are the clothes? In the, ask in the her. I'm telling you, ask her. I don't know. Does I she, just fall asleep. Does she speak English? So here, here's the other thing. Yeah, no, it's not right. I'd appreciate your names on there, but we also needed her name because she was also in the car trespassing. So with the, just getting the plate would have only given us your name, not hers. Well, honestly, That's I'll all we're honest, trying to do, I'll, man. I know, but what you did right now, it's literally, it's, uh, for a refugee, that's way off what you did. Honestly. And the other thing is when he says don't close the door and you try to slam it in his face, we don't know Obviously, if you're going for a how, weapon or something, how, man. So how are you going to... You just leave me an entrapment. So y'all literally did me an entrapment. Y'all asked me to leave, but if I'm he about to leave... He leave. He told you why we were here. No, he told and me to leave. we have to finish he the contact. To he told me to leave. He told and me, we have to finish the contact, which is know who's in there. So if you were to come back, we could so take you out... So you're telling me to leave first and then contact to, to identify me. Not to identify yourself it's and an then... the entire leave. system. We tell you why no, we're you here, what's you, you going on, and you then we need your name. All right, man, we're, we're done arguing with you. No, I need so to talk going... to the supervisor. Honestly, I need to talk okay, to... Okay, well, you can call tomorrow.
Officer, I need to talk to supervisor. I have my right. In there. No, I have a right, man. I have rights. I don't do you need to do your rights? Yes. Yeah, and, and did I, anyone I, I have those supervisor. rights that say you have a right to a supervisor? I, I, yeah, no, I, 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 no, I need a So I got uh, shorts, pants, shoes, and your cell phone. Is there anything else you'd like to get from the car? It's going to get locked up and left here for the night. And we got her a hotel room so she's not stuck in the van alone, okay? Uh, if my car breaks, if somebody breaks in my car, not because of you, and what's now? If somebody breaks into your car, yeah. you, you can file a report tomorrow with us. The suspect was charged with obstructing a law enforcement officer and trespassing second degree. For more videos about criminals, hit the subscribe button.